PFS file system in the AWS okay so go to the AWS management console okay this is my AWS management console so I want to create a two EC2 instance first okay so I will create a two EC2 instance So instead of the, in my scenario, I am taking the Linux instance. Okay, go to launch the instance. Give launch instance. Launch instance, I will take Amazon. Okay, so then configure the instance. So instead of I will take the default one, so I can give one A and give add storage and tag and security group. So security group, I will create a one security group. So EC2 hyphen security group. Okay, I will give the security group. Default, I will give the SSH configuration here. Okay, so SSH configuration I will create it now. Okay, so give launch, launch. So I will create a new EC2 key pair. Okay, so what is a key pair means EC2, okay, king. I will give the EC2 king. So download the PEM key and launch the instance. Okay, then go to the second. I want to create a other one instance also. So I will give the instance name is EC2 1 save okay then again I will create a one again one EC2 instance okay AWS and launch configuration and availability zone 1B okay then add storage add tag add security group same exiting security group which i have created here okay before i created one security group ec2 security group okay so ec2 security group i will create it now give launch instance and launch so same keeper exiting keeper so i will give the ec2 king okay ec2 king i will give the keeper now exiting keeper okay so then go to the ec2 okay so i will give the instance name is ec2 2 okay so give the save name okay once you can create the two ec2 instance okay so i want to convert the pum key to putty. okay putty zen okay go to the putty gen so go to the key and load the key okay so location which location that key is having download okay all files what is the name key key 2 okay so give ec2 king pim So EC2 King PEM key. Okay, so I will check the key where is having that key. EC2 EC2 King. Okay, so here I having my EC2 King. Okay, give OK. Then I save the key, give the name S. Yes. I can give the EC2 King 1. Okay, 2, 3 okay one two three but location in desktop in uh, location is i will give um, book location books location okay then give save then i will close that okay so uh, i will convert the key also then what i want to do i want to create a key pair okay so we want to create a sorry security group so which security group we want to create here so two okay so uh, very important thing efs security group i want to create now so my efs okay so give my efs same my efs 
okay ec2 okay same i can give ec2 okay my efs ec2 my security group name so i want to add the inbound rule i will add the inbound rule so inbound rule i will add the nfs give nfs okay so i will give custom so here the source i will give the which location means i will added my security group here which i will created before okay so what is my security group name ec2 okay so ec2 security group so i want to attach the security group here ec2 okay ec2 security group okay i will attach the security group and i can give say create a security group that's all okay so my efs hyphen ec2 i created one security group then i will go to the efs okay go to the efs so i will create a efs system okay so here i will copy the file okay so go to the ec2 okay go to the efs file system i want to create a new file system go to the create efs so go to customized efs i can give my my efs new my efs new then i will give uh, so enable the duplication okay encryption i am not doing any encryption okay give next so the in this network very very important so default security group is available i will delete the default security group and i will attach the security group which i have created before okay what is the security group name okay so what security group i created here so ec w okay ec sw it is my uh, ec2 security group but i will create other security group also what is the security group name my efs security group same i want to attach the same security group my efs security group okay my efs security group my efs security group okay then again i will add this security group my efs security group okay i will attach the my my efs security group here okay give next okay give next okay then give create a efs file system okay my efs new file system i will create okay so it is creating now okay go to my efs okay so come down so just i want to see the monitoring file system metrics file system policies okay so all the things it is available here okay go to the file systems if i just i selected here file system view the details view the view the details you can getting the all the information about the systems okay uh, monitoring file system policy access okay network okay so it is creating now okay just you can give refresh it is creating so now what i want to do i want to attach the security group go to the attaching the security group we have the two option okay so instead of here 
so i want to use the user guidedness so user guidedness if you go to user guidedness mounting on the support ec2 okay so there is a option is available okay so manually installing the efs client okay so that is the first thing mounting the file system without the efs mount helper okay so uh, first one manually i want to install the efs client so manually i want to install my efs client mean first what i want to do first i want to install the m install m y install efs utility okay so where i want to install this one i want to install the putty software okay go to the putty go to putty so first i will connect the my systems okay so instead of here go to running instance okay so first i will select the instance number 1 okay so i get the detail instance detail i copy the public file okay i will paste it here okay then ssh configuration authentication browse uh, in book in location is book desktop mm, okay books okay so in ec2 king 123 okay so i trying to opening the system yes so ec2 hyphen user okay so this is a uh, my system number 1 same i want to connect the system number 2 also go to putty same i will select the other system okay system number 2 okay so system number 2 instance public and paste it here and go to authentication browse ec2 working 1 2 and give open okay give yes then ec2 hyphen user so the authentication is over okay so i am having a two systems okay so see the differentiation here one is 172 31 10.47 one is 47. 172.31.47.253. Okay, so so first I want to change the root credential. sudo bash. So same thing I want to give here sudo bash. Okay, so what I want to do the same two systems. So go to manual installation. So I want to install the utility. okay i will copy this one first i will installed first i will install this system okay then same i will install the second system so first i will enter this one this so is manually installed right now so same thing i want to install the same system configuration okay so totally i am getting the two systems utility is over so what is the other thing what you want to do you want to do the second step what is the step you want to do okay ef facility then you want to create a directory now so you want to create a directory and which 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 the name of the directory name so what is the directory name i want to create it means here okay so so mk dir efs okay same thing mk dir efs same two directories are i am created now then i want to mount the directory okay so this directory i want to mount so how is possible to mount the directory 
so go to back so then i will close this one okay so then go to efs so i want to mount the directory so this is the mounting file so i will copy this file and i will paste it here okay so i will paste this mount same i will paste this so i will enter here so it will properly mounted same thing i will mounted here so it is properly mounted now so what i want to do i want to attach the client now so i want to attach the client now okay so i will copy and paste it to the attachment same i will copy and paste it the attachment okay give enter same give enter here okay so once i mounted the file and i will give the uh, attachment then then i can give ls and i have navigated to efs so i can give ls it is not having anything okay so here i will create a one file okay touch test1 dot txt enter okay sorry so i will give touch test2 test1 dot txt enter so give ls a txt okay i will create it here same file system i will i go to ls i give cd efs then give ls so now you are getting the same file okay which i am created in the location of 172 31 47 255 in my ec2 instance same i will the getting this file in the other location of my file so i can able to edit the file also here or how it can possible give um, same touch touch what is the file name test 1 dot t s t okay so so i will write something nano nano test test1 dot test okay test okay so nano test1 dot test i can give enter i will write how are you okay then i can give save file control o enter control x okay so once you can check the file so cat okay so i will check the file test 1 dot txt okay so you can getting the same file same i will check here give ls then give cat test 1 dot txt okay give enter see so whatever i will uh, edit this file same file i am getting here location okay so this is the efs file system management okay so you can go through the video and any doubt you can ask me okay thank you